My wife has given me three girls in a row. And you're asking me to calm down? No, now. Is there a law that says that female children are not children? No. But three girls. Are they children? Are they not children? Please. Derek, you were all over the place asking me to plead with your wife for you. Even when she said she wasn't going to get married to you, it did not stop you. You didn't get off her back. I want to believe you married her because you loved her. So what is all of this? At the beginning of this marriage, you started complaining and whining about her career, about her inconsistency and all of that when you of all people knew that she was a banker even before you proposed to her. Wait, hold on a second. Wait a minute. Where is the relation? All that I'm saying, how is that related to what you are saying? All that you are saying, what are you not saying? What is your complaint right now? What are you complaining about? Are well, you not listening to all that I've been saying? Your point is baseless. Are you serious? My point is baseless? Derek, why do you keep coming to me? Why do you keep running to me each time you have crisis in your marriage? Are you serious? Are you the one saying this? I'm the one saying this, Derek. Let us call a spade a spade for once. Derek, why? 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 Did you run to me when you were busy gallivanting and sleeping with your nanny right on your matrimonial bed? Did you come asking for skills from me? Oh. Oh. You didn't expect me to know that, yes? You thought that would be hidden? Let me tell you, there is nothing hidden on that sun. Oh, yeah. You see the leg that works endlessly? It is the eyes that watches endlessly that will see it. Now I understand why I cannot mingle with your type. Why I just cannot be with your type. Because you won't submit to a man. You just won't. And you think because you're in this house, you're successful and that's it. And that's the reason why you are not married. Derek, if this is your definition, for submission then to hell with it to hell with it Derek how dare you come to my house to insult me the house that you will live be in remain and die single oh uh -huh. you think I don't see suitors oh, suitors you think I don't see suitors Derek where them, where them I have quite a handful of them I don't see and if you were a woman a submissive woman I would probably share some tips with you but even if you were a woman your ego, all of this, would not let you. I'm not a woman. You cannot be. I don't want to be a woman. You cannot be a woman. Get married. Grow some hair. Grow some sense. Carry wig. Carry sense. Carry anything. Put on, in fact, carry some of their eyelashes. Put for head. So that the men can see you and like you and propose. Submit. Get married. Because your house will not marry you. Think it's all about being a fine boy? Huh? It is men like you that makes me not even give it a thought. I cannot take this nonsense. Oh God, you are a baggage of national crisis. You call me, you raise your hand. We have here um toasted bread with um egg tomato sauce oh baby come on this has to be for the girls don't want stuff like that i need you to serve me something you know that will give me some energy like pounded yam and bitter leaf soup something that will give me energy to mount you uh, baby please that can wait let me just take came out to school and come back you know, whatever it is, you can take up school after you give it. Baby, right? please, no. It can wait. Let me just go and come back. Please. No way. No. Baby, no. No. Baby, please. Your wife warned that Kaima must not go to school today today. So can you please allow me to take her to school? I will come back and be with you. Yes. 
please. Olivia, I am the man of this house. Okay? I am the man of this house. I get what I want exactly when I want it. And right now, I want you. And I will get it. Hey, please. Please, don't do it. Come on. Yourself all worked up for nothing. I mean, you should be thanking me for taking good care of your husband for you in your absence. What? Yes, you should be thanking me for those cold weather I had to be there for him when you least cared what because of him. Yes, you should be thanking me for making sure he stays at home instead of running into the hands of those slay queens out there. Oh my God. Hilda, you should be thanking me for keeping your husband at home. Yes, making sure he fits well and had good quality sex. Should I still go on and mention them? Hilda, God gave you a sweet, handsome man as a husband. Instead of you to relax and marry the man God gave you, what did you do? You decided to be married to your job instead. This is banker. Oh, I'm out of here. Get out. Get out and stay far away from my home! Bye, sugar. Derek. Derek, how could you? How could you? How could you do this to me? I mean, if I should say I told me that you will come this and so low to her level, I would never have believed it. Where are you going, Derek? I asked you, what is, what, what, what is, what is this? What is this? Hilda, I am a man with blood running through my veins. I'm not just a boy walking around, okay? One, I ask you to resign your job as a banker. You refused. Secondly, I ask for sex, and all you do is come up with billions of excuses oh, why you cannot. Ah! Oh yeah, I'm not done. You see, you don't take care of my needs and our needs, and you focus on your work. As if that is more important than what we share. Do you, do you know how I survive those cold nights? Do you know how I survive my sexual edges? Do you know what I do? No, you don't. Because you love your job more than you love us. Now, if Olivia is gone, hey, I've satisfied myself, okay? I'm next. Karen, you are off my level! What manner of a man are you? You, you were caught pet down with your ass open and you got no form of remorse for what your action has done to me in our marriage. Remorse? For what? Remorse for what? Sleeping with my nanny, my own nanny, the nanny that I paid, not somebody else's mind. I should be remorseful. That's bullshit. Okay? <laughs> you are, you're my baby, you're not going anyway. No, Derek, you're not going anyway. You have to tell me why you did this. Why? Why did you do this, Derek? Why did you do this? Don't touch me. Why did you do this? If you get foul and I will touch you back. Don't. Don't touch me. Excuse me. Stop, stop, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. I don't owe you, you owe me. anyone an apology. Derek, you owe me. This is my house. You, you, you owe me. my wife. You owe me a then, 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 then do your duties. You owe me a bunch. You owe me. Stop it. 